Hey, yo guys, it is me, Happy Sire. <laughs> Happy Sire again. Welcome back to the long dark. So in the previous episode, we found this community hall. And today I want to go outside and start hunting because I want to get different shoes as from what I know, rabbit boots are the best boots. And for now I have only these new work boots. But when I go here to the clothes menu and uh, deer skin boots, also not rabbit boots, but those deer skin boots. So I want to hunt a couple of deers and this way we'll be able to have the best boots in the game. Also, there are like those mukuklas or whatever they're called, but they're pretty hard to come by and I'd love to craft at least some sort of an item myself and the sad part is that it's super foggy outside yikes so i'd love to stick around here but i'm gonna get my gun and i think i'm gonna start heading this way because there we'll be able to find some sort of a farm where in story mode that woman saved us that's where ada's astrid's not ada her name isn't ada where astrid's story started so i want to go to that farm and i'm st still playing with the map and i think i've heard the deer can those deers roam during this weather? I have no idea. Again, hopefully I don't meet any wolves on the way. I would not want to fight them. And I'll do my best to stick to the road because if I'll start roaming too far, I'll 100% lose the way because it's pretty hard to navigate yourself in this kind of weather. Okay, so I saw a car. Let's go, let's loot the car. Already I wanted to go and smash these barrels because recently I was playing lots of and lots of rust. <laughs> so I just wanted to go and start smashing those barrels. Okay, so let's hide the weapon. I just don't want to shoot it accidentally in the car. I don't even think that's possible, but whatever. Okay, so nothing here. And once again, don't forget to smash the like button on the video because your likes do support these videos. Thank you guys so much for all your support. I really, really appreciate that. And I'm not saying this just, oh, psych appreciates, haha. I really, guys, appreciate all your support. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching the videos. You guys are the best and look at that everything's brightening up nice so once again i'm gonna go get my rifle i'll go somewhere here on the very tippity oh that's a wolf that's definitely a wolf slag don't aim at them yeah i do know that when you aim at the wolfos they will start running towards you in any case i need to find two deers we're gonna pop him and then i'm gonna craft two epic boots even though again it's gonna take quite a bit of time to dry that leather but we don't have nowhere else to go and again judging by the map yeah we're just gonna go a bit a bit straighter yeah, yeah a bit straight and somewhere there there's the barn all right it's not that far in my head it seemed a bit more far in the story mode the road seems longer not gonna lie but here we walked so much. Since the first episode, imagine how many steps we've already taken. Like, I'm pretty sure there has to be somewhere in, in the options, maybe. I don't even know where. Here, some things probably. Calories expanded, maybe distance traveled 57 kilometers. Okay, that's nice. Kilometers, kilometers, who cares? It's the same thing. Okay, so let's try to loot the car. Did I take my crowbar? I'm not sure. Maybe I have taken a crowbar. Nope, nothing here. I'm gonna check the back seat. I hear lots of wolfos. Simple toolbox used for basic crafting and repair. I mean, it's one kilo for now. I'll take it But as soon as I run out of space, I'll probably drop it I have only like four extra kilos that I could take with me, but whatever. Okay, so let's loot here more Cardboard thing is and we can drink this goop you guys told me that you're not really gonna get poisoning from drinking sodas So let's drink stale sodas. I guess correct. Yeah, I didn't vomit. <laughs> I didn't vomit I didn't have diarrhea. That's beautiful. That gets Ike's like, approval. Okay, so we're at the barn and I see a deer. You know what that means. Once again, I'm double checking. Oh, so even the map doesn't say that deers would spawn here, but they still spawn. So yeah, map isn't 100% correct. So I'll try to pop that deer. Can I sneak? How do I get him? Can I get him from over here? Let's sneak attack and let's just do boom. It's like you missed the shot. Boom. Two deers running. Yikes. Okay, so it kind of stopped. Nice. Nice. Can I do another boom? Boom! Boom! How is it still alive? It's like you're wasting your shot. Stop it. I know what's going on. I, I lost one deer already. I didn't want to lose this one. Okay, so it, it starts losing blood. Nice. All I have to do is just chase it. I do know there's the farm. We could loot it. But as I said, I don't need to get the, the deer. Can I get perhaps one more shot? That would be stupid to waste it. I don't even know if there's the bullet drop in this game. Well, I'll probably just follow the blood trail and that's it. If there will be wolves, I'll pop them. We had some bullets. I know we are kind of wasting them. But hey, let's at least waste bullets before we die, right? Because in a lot of games, from what I've learned, that sometimes, you know, I'm going to find something and I'm just not going to use it. And then I just lose those items and I die and I never get to use them. So let's at least use the bullets here. All right, is the deer over there? Do I even go in the right place? I feel like it's a big mistake to even come here. Okay, I see some blood trails. 
Nice, finally uh, found some more blood trails, baby. Nice, nice, nice. How on earth did that deer run so far? Do I go in the forest or do I just turn back? Probably I should just head back to the to the barn. Maybe I'll find another deer. And I should probably take shots from closer. And I am tired! Are you kidding me? How on earth is that possible? That's it, I'm not going further. I'm going just back now. I'm just gonna take this old man's beard lich and whatever it's called. It's not that heavy. It's just for antiseptic. Oh, so those are not deer footsteps. Those are just... The tree's footsteps, all right. So probably I'll stop running because yeah, as soon as I run, I can even see my energy depleting there. I get tired really, 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 really quick. I even want to click G here to open up the map, but nope, it's not rust. Everything is rust to me. Play one game for too long, all the games look the same. <laughs> so basically I've already met three deers and all of those three deers ran away. Well, regardless, they're gonna respawn and we're gonna be able to pop them. Shouldn't be big of a deal. Oh yeah, it definitely got brighter. Now we see further. Yes, I see another deer over there. Do I try to get that shot? But there's the wolfo in front of me. We can pop that wolf. I don't care about the wolf. We are really close to the farm location. I could sleep and wait out because if I'm gonna kill him, I'm not gonna be able to take the stuff, correct? Does that make sense? Wait, it's not even the right house. It's just the farmhouse. That's not where she lived. Oh, so for that house, I need to go even further. Yeah, yeah, because it's definitely too close. This is just some sort of a farmhouse. That's where she was hiding and we had to save her or something. I don't even know, May. Whatever, I'll hop inside probably. We're gonna take a little bit of a rest. And people usually keep telling me that hey, Sayak, just read the book, Sayak, do this instead of sleeping. But usually the only reason why I sleep is just to restore my energy here. Okay, so that's some sort of a note. Newspaper, I don't need this goop. And another quality tools cloth, I'll take it. So we'll loot here the top floor and somewhere there probably I'll drop my sleeping bag. And it'll sleep, sleep. Dusty sulfur could be used for crafting ammunition. I mean, it's only 100 grams, that's why I'm taking it. Painkillers are like 10 grams, let's take them. Even though they're a bit out of date, it looks like, but I, I don't think we're gonna get poisoning from those painkillers. A firearm cleaning kit. We already have lots of them. Dealing decent scarf goop. We don't need that. And we don't need this goop. Okay, so this is just a book. We don't need it. As they're pretty heavy, they're good to start the fire. They're probably all right to use the fuel. Cured leather, scrap metal, nope. And dog food. Is it all right? 64%. Yes, we can definitely eat that. So that's it. We've looted this entire barn besides the car. I haven't looted the car yet. So let's check if there's anything here besides that spray can. No, we don't need that spray paint can. And soda. Yes, let's take it. So I'm gonna drop the sleeping bag and that's it. Hopefully I don't freeze to death in the night, but I don't think I should as we have really great clothes. I don't see a reason why would we... Why would we freeze to death? I don't see that happening. I mean, it might happen, but we don't know. Also, you told me that we can eat crackers and everything's all right with the crackers. You told me that if crackers are gonna be like at 49%, it's fine. You're not really gonna get a food poisoning from a little bit stale crackers. But I am kind of scared. I don't want to risk it. Let's go to sleep sleep for about like 10 hours. Are we gonna go in during the night? I think we could go during the night. You woke up fully rested. And I'm almost out of water. We will require to get a bit more water. Yeah, that said, I drank all the water. That is a little bit problematic. I just literally drank some maple <laughs> syrup. Do I have any books to research? Here go, firearm researching thing. So I can lay research probably for a couple of hours until morning. It's too dark to read. <laughs> I'm gonna take the bedroll and probably I'm gonna go outside. Is outside gonna be super dark? Oh, it's not even too dark. It's the Aurora night now. Nice. Can you hunt animals during Aurora? Can you or can you not? Those are the questions. Okay, tractor, energy oh, I bar. Still eat this. 47%. I think we can pop it. 46% isn't that bad. The stupid wolfos are skid. There's the deer. So yeah, I'll try to pop the deer. I'll try to skid him probably during this Aurora. Oh no, that was another shiny wolf. That wasn't even a deer. That wasn't even a deer. Well, while it's kind of bright, I think I should go outside to that house with the basement that I was talking about in the beginning of the video. Again, there might be wolf foes. They might be chasing me, but... Oh, no. This wolf foe might chase me, correct? Schmuck. What the flip, mate? Oh, my goodness. With, th with this, what is going on? What is going on? Why did he attack me during this Aurora? Schmuck! I'll have to go repair my clothes now! What a stupid schmook! I'll have to repair a little bit of my clothes. Yeah, hopefully they're not gonna get destroyed. Is Aurora disappearing? Can I read the book dur here during Aurora? I mean, because it's kind of bright, so let's try to get this sewing kit. Let's try to read it for like three hours. It's bright outside to read. I am kind of getting a little bit cold, but that's all right. I can read for one extra hour probably, and we are not gonna freeze to death. Yeah, I'm just reading outside. Imagine going outside to read. <laughs> cool, it's somewhat middle of the night. Yeah, I can read for one extra hour to research that sewing kit fully. I think I heard a wolf out close to me. 
Yeah, there's the wolf. Oh, yeah, I'm gapping back inside of the base. It's somewhat bright here, but yeah, I'm gonna get back my lantern. I'll probably cook some water. Yeah, let's start the fire. I have no tinder. So there was a book upstairs. I think you can use a book as tinder, no? Let's go. Let's try to take that book from over here. Where was it? Please tell me there was a book. And I yes. Here we go. There's the book. And I want to start the fire just to craft some water. Because I have no water at all. Let's go here. Start fire. Oh, you still can't even uh, use it as tinder. Just rip away a few pages from the book, you idiot. Well, I'm going to craft a tinder plug. It's like five minutes to craft it. Well, here we go. I'm going to start the fire even with accelerant just to make it a bit faster. Let's go to fire barrel, add fuel, reclaimed wood. Yes, I'm going to add this. Well, I'm going to add one lump of coal. Let's go to a simple can and I'm going to melt some snow. I'm stupid. I was using my lantern all the time and I ran out of fuel. Please tell me I have more lantern fuel. Where's my lantern? Here go the lantern. Actions. Uh, refuel it. Okay, so I still can refuel it a little bit. Nice. We still have a little bit of fuel. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. So I'm gonna place my bedroll and once again, six, eight hours to sleep, sleep. And hopefully it's not some sort of a storm outside. It sounds like it's not stormy outside. Sounds like it's quite quiet. I'll drink a few cups of coffee because yeah, that's the only liquid I got. Well, that is legitimately bad. I should be getting more water. Oh, it's kind of snowing a little bit. It's not big of it. There's a bear. What is a bear doing here? Sayak, fight him, fight him! So I'll have to run back inside of this barn as soon as I shoot him. Let's try that out. I mean, I'm kind of scared. How many shots does the bear take? We can Google that. Well, it looks like it depends. Sometimes you can kill him with three shots, sometimes with more. We have the bullets, but I don't think I should be wasting them on that bear, especially that I don't eat a skin. But that would be fun to hunt the bear. Now, well, I see the deers. Three deers! Let's try to get at least one deer then, okay? I'll try to get closer. Let's try to get those deers. Let's try to grab the shoes. Let's do it. Okay, that deer is running now, probably. Dead. I'm not sure if I missed it. Two deers. Two deers. I did it! Feels bad, but again, that's just a game. That's just a game. Stupid wolf will shut your mouth. So there's one deer, then there's another deer. So deer carcass. Do I have a knife? Maybe it's gonna be faster. Okay, so to get his hides, right? So that's gotta be a deer hide. Obviously, it's gotta be a deer hide. So your knife is the fastest plus I need to get his guts too. And I'd love to get the meat, but whatever. Let's get, harvest this at first. At least I'm not freezing. At least I'm not freezing. Here go, I got this. Do I need to get his meat? It's like, it's gonna take me an hour and 17 minutes to get the 9 kilos of meat. Let's get it. But I don't really need that much food. We have already lots of food. I'm gonna take 9 kilos and that's it. To drop some gear. Shut your mouth. Okay, so what could I drop? That's a lot of meat! I'm dropping it. Call me crazy. But I'm dropping a lot of the meat. At least right now. Whatever, we'll see. Maybe I'll pick it back later. I don't know, mate. I don't know what about what about the meat. It takes lots of time to cook it, whatever, unless I get to that different place. 90, 39% frozen. Let's get this. I don't think I need more guts, correct? Let's try to go quickly in my inventory into crafting menu. Clothes and deer skin boots. I just need, oh, four cured guts. So I need more guts then, okay. So let's take the guts and let's take the, hi uh, the hide. I'm gonna take everything here. And night is coming in again, are you kidding me? You know what I think I'll do? I might take the meat that I dropped over here. Let's, did I just eat it? Oh no, I'm taking it, good. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Shut your mouth! Stop complaining, dude! I'm fighting as hard as I can, and yet you're just whining and whining. Psych, what are you planning to do? I want to get back to the barn, I'll drop all of that meat. I don't really know how long it lasts though, just in case, you know, if I'll ever need it. Just in case we start to death. I'll know that I can go back to this barn location and I'll have some meat there. Now I need to start curing the leather hides. Should I just drop them in the barn location and they'll dry little by little somehow, some way? Can they dry in the barn location? Probably they can. It takes a few days to dry, so I'll probably just drop it here. I have to remember about this barn, guys. Let's remember about this barn, me and you. <laughs> let's go, so somewhere here, I just need to find a box. Or maybe I'll just drop it in the car. Wait, let's enter the vehicle. Let's put down the weapon. Let's open up the empty glove box. Let's go to the food location. Where's the food? Here go, there's the food and I'm gonna drop all the meat in the glove box. See, I'm gonna drop five kilos of meat in the glove box. It's gonna spoil there immediately. Let's be honest here. 
I will also probably drop now those hides and guts. Here we go. Let's drop one gut. Or maybe they can even stay in your inventory to dry. They don't have to really cure here, but I'm just gonna drop them here. I don't want to carry that stuff with me. Here we go. Drop four of that stuff. Now let's drop a fresh deer hides. 1% cured and uh, more deer highs. Nice. Nice. Okay, so all of that stuff is gonna dry. I'll try to get to the tippity top. And somewhere here, I'm gonna drop more meat. That's why I should have dropped that meat in the first place. Not in the glove box. But I'm not gonna go down now to get rid of that meat from the glove box. I'm not that stupid. You're okay, gonna drop all the meat. Oh my goodness, why did you run out there? <laughs> run downstairs? What an idiot. Well, I see another wolf also. I'll probably try to avoid him. What time is it? Oh, night is coming in. Night is coming in. Well, I don't care about the night. We have some bullets. I still have lots of shots. We still have the revolver. So I'll try to get back on the road. Wait, am I going back on the road? I don't know where's the road. I'm lost. I need guidance. I need my northern star. Okay, I see a couple of crates that we could probably destroy for whatever resources. But I don't really need more wood. Maybe I actually do need more wood. Well, I'll take all of those sticks. And that's it. I'm going back on the road and I'm going to that different house that we need to loot because I can't really stay here at home all the time. I just thought that this thing is a zombie. I was like, what? Zombies in this game? That would be probably terrifying. Like, if I saw a zombie running at me here right now, I would probably close the game and never turn it on again. <laughs> and the cool part about your shots is that if you're gonna scare the wolf or if you're gonna shoot him once, the rest of the wolves are just gonna run away. So, it's not like I'll be required to waste lots of shots. I already wasted lots of shots, let's be honest here. That was kind of stupid. It's always like that, you know, when you don't have something, like when I had three bullets, I was saving every single bullet. Every bullet counted. And here when I had lots of them, I'm like, boom, bam, boom, as if I'm spraying here with an automatic gun. <laughs> as if it's an assault rifle or something. Well, nothing on the back of this car. Wait, have I looted this car in the past? I think I have. I think I've looted the car here. Yeah, I've looted it. Yeah, let's battle. So I'm just gonna keep going straight. I don't really know how long it takes for that leather to cure, but I don't think it's gonna... Sp Boil or rot or go bad so it can stay there however much time it wants. I mean however much time it needs But I'm gonna go straight. I'm gonna go to that house. Is it Merlene's house? I don't remember her name I wish I remembered her name, but those who watched my story mode or those who've played the game You know which woman I'm talking about. I need to drink. That's what I know. Oh, we have little We have one liter of water. How I've missed this nice here we go. I've eaten some crackers. I drank a little bit. I'm gonna start running. Again, I'm getting more tired when I'm running. I know that. But it's dark anyways. I'll have to sleep regardless. So I might as well use that stamina for good. So that house is supposed to be pretty big. So my goal is to get there. And we're gonna start exploring it. Maybe we'll fight someone else. I'd love to fight that bear who was really, really far away. Because the more I read, like, people are saying, you know, you can just shoot that bear once. And then it's just gonna bleed to death. You can just hide and wait somewhere. Which we could have done. But at the same time, I'm thinking, what's the point of that bear? You know, if I knew what could it do with that bear probably would pop him also while i'm walking can i check those crampons are they losing durability they have 99 durability so it's kind of useless to take off those crampons maybe i'd move faster if i take them off just maybe just maybe okay let's pray open the trunk it's so nice you know when you're walking in the evening and you're trying to reach some sort of a house i think that's really atmospheric so so far i would say that the Long Dark is one of the most atmospheric survival games that I've ever played. Like, I've played lots of survival games here on the channel. And The Long Dark definitely puts you in the mood of survival. It can make you feel cold, even if it's not cold. Like, right now, I feel like it's evening. It gives you the feeling that, hey, you need to find the house, you need to find the shelter. It's just a nice feeling. Also, just cross the bridge, so that's it. We have to go over here, and we can find the, ha the house. Wait, is that our house? Is that the house with the basement? I think it is! I think we found it! Nice! That was way faster than I thought. Whatever, let's loot the tractor. Maybe we'll find here a Kit Kat bar. Nope, nothing. No Snickers, no Kit Kat bars. Okay, let's... So night can't be far behind. Shut your mouth. Or maybe this is not even her house. It can't be her house yet. Yeah, it's not her house. It's just like some sort of a barn. Yeah, yeah, it's not a house yet. But I still think it's worth it to go and loot this place. I'm gonna take this lantern just to harvest it. Wooden matches. I'm not taking more wooden matches. You might call me crazy, this. but I already have like a kilo of matches. I don't think I'll ever be able to use them. I'm gonna again take this dusting sulfur. What if I'll be able to craft bullets one day? What if we go to that place and it's not that heavy? I uh, don't need to take that much wood. My kneecaps are going to break. So I can carry 40 kilos and, uh, and yeah, it's dropping because we keep getting more and more tired. Which lantern am I using right now? I'm probably using the other one. Okay, so I'm gonna go here. I'll go to actions. Harvesting is gonna take us one hour, so I'm gonna hide this and actions and I'll try to harvest it. One hour is pretty 
long. But I'm gonna get some fuel. Look at this. I harvested scrap of metal and uh, almost one liter of fuel. Nice. Now we can go over here. I can drop that metal that I found. Here we go. I don't need that metal. My guy's kind of tired and I don't want to sleep here. I want to get to that place first. And sleep, sleep in the in that barn. Is it again Aurora Knight? What's up with that Aurora Knight? So hopefully I don't break my kneecaps while I'm going. That's gotta be her house. I, I don't know what else can that be. So as soon as I get there, we will sleep. We will start cooking. I will repair all of my clothes. There is lots of stuff that we have to do. So we're gonna use lots of and lots of that time. And hopefully that deer hide and those guts are gonna cure and they'll dry. So there's a car that we could loot, but probably I'll loot it in the morning. We did it here. Nope, I heard nothing. I thought I heard a wolf coming after me. So here we go. That is her house. That's what I was talking about, baby. Yes. Also, there has to be a basement and we will get there. But first of all, let's go inside of the base. Oof. I thought that we were gonna load in, but we didn't and something happened and I got scared. But it's just the, the, the door opened up to the porch. Is that porch? Can we call this a porch? Probably. Whatever. Let's hop inside of the base and will we have any light inside? I mean, we have a little bit of light. Probably we will loot it in the morning. It's so cool that it's not a horror game. You know that I come here, I don't have to be scared. Because usually during those horror games, you have to be like, <gasps> what's gonna be on the top? And you go there like, uh. But here it's peaceful. You know, there's nobody lives here. And I just get jump scared. And once again, I turn off the game, but I'd never play it again. <laughs> Where's the bed? Bed, 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 bedroom. Is the bedroom here? Yes! We found the bed, baby, so let's go to sleep, sleep. I'm gonna hide this. I'll probably drink some water before we go to sleep. Obviously not gonna go to sleep thirsty. Even in real life, I drink lots of water before I go to sleep. Then I need to pee pee, but that's another story. And boom, let's go to sleep, sleep for about like eight, ten hours. Let's go sleep, sleep. Ten hours, baby. You woke up fully rested. What time is it? It's almost morning, so that's... Not that bad. We can roam around the house with that uh, lantern that I got. We have lots of fuel for it, so let's use it. I'm gonna eat those energy bars. Oh, we're good. I don't need anything else. I'm not hungry anymore. And plus, it's a storm outside. When there is the storm outside, you can hear the wind howling, the wind blowing, whatever. You can also hear, like, something doing the tuk -tuk 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 in the night. It's like some sort of a door that's not closed or whatever. It's like, it feels so realistic. I just love it. I love the sound design in this game. I think that's what gives the highest feel of immersion. Okay, so those simple leather boots, we could this. prop. No, you couldn't use it. We're not gonna disassemble them into leather. Or maybe we will. Maybe we will because I need to repair some of my clothes, but I'll start repairing them as soon as morning comes in because I don't wanna waste my lantern to repair the clothes. Yes, so we can. I'll take it. I'll take it, I'll take it. So yeah, I'll probably start looting from the tippity top, from the top floor, and then we'll go lower. If I won't have enough cloth, I'll know that we can get that scarf there. This will come handy. No, it won't. Just shut your mouth. <laughs> You're not gonna take those jeans. Uh, beef jerky. E we can eat it, baby. We can definitely eat it. Let's take it back into my pocket. Drawer empty. No, why did you extinguish the lantern? What a stupid guy. Okay, newspaper. We could probably take the newspaper as the Kindle, right? As the Tinder. Okay, so I looted this. Wait, have I checked everything? I mean, there's the book, but it's just useless book for the fire. There's the metal scrap, something under the bed. Uh, nothing. Oh, this is just a broken TV. Even if I came here to this house, I would have to put the TV properly, like... I don't know why it would feel really bad to see this TV on the floor. <laughs> I'd have to pick it up. I couldn't just leave it like that. Antibiotics. Do I need them? Let's take them. Towel. We could again get it for cloth. Lots of towels for cloth. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Energy bar. I mean, 11%. Should I eat it? I mean, I'm kind of scared to eat it even. I mean, I think we can eat those energy bars. Let's go. If I die from energy bar, baby, that wasn't worth it to live for me here. Okay, I didn't die. Nice. Maybe I'm worthy after all. Oh, I see a backpack over there in the corner. So far, I got nothing inside of those lockers besides like a t-shirt or something. Stale beef jerky. I don't think I'll eat this. And new salty crackers. Let's take them. So I think I've looted the entire top floor. Now let's loot the down floor. Okay, nothing in the table. Is it even the same place where she saved me? I think it is. I just kind of don't remember it. We here? Another sewing kit. More books that I'll never take. Wait, is that a good book? Not just a book for the fire. All of these books are for... To start the fire. Why are you extinguishing it, stupid guy? I told him to open up the chest. And he's like, Bravo 6, going dark. Shook <laughs> for the second time in a row. <laughs> open this plastic container, please. Decent dress shirt, water bottle. I think we're gonna take it. Tin of coffee, eh. Almost never really used it anyways. Sport vest is all right. Wool mittens are all right, but I don't need them. Oh, I haven't looked at those file containers yet. They'll be jerky. So I just got one extra newspaper. 
And that's it. More wool mittens. Wait, what is that? Oh, that's just a magnifying glass over there. I'm pretty sure I can start the fire with it, maybe. Soda. Let's pop some soda. Let's drink. Let's eat. Oh, here we go. Wilderness kitchen. I'm probably gonna take it to research this. Revolver ammunition. Yes, 10 rounds. Yes, baby. I'm glad that I used that ammo in the past. Cup of herbal tea. Imagine I saw this cup of thingy and I'm like, yeah, let's take it with me. Let's drink it. And another book that I don't need. More fire, wooden matches. This I don't need them. Oh, wait, I could bra bra bring the meat here and cook it. Could I cook it here or I need like a better stove to cook three meats at the same time? But I think even if I have the meat, I'm still gonna stink and both holes are gonna chase me. Maybe, perhaps, I don't know. More soda, let's loot the fridge. Maple syrup, good, 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 good. Condensed milk, that's just good. Oh no, it's like 35%, but I think it's condensed milk. You can eat it. I'll eat it if I, again, vomit from it. Where I have diarrhea, it's fine, it's my fault. Still eat this. Yes, peaches. As I said, we'll probably stay here in this place for quite a bit of time. Stale peanut butter. I think we can eat that peanut butter, even if it's stale, not gonna die, mate. This is the cool place. We can probably cook six meats at the same time. That's what I need to do. So we're gonna try to bring that meat. I'll definitely try to bring that Too meat. Heavy. Shut your mouth! It's so annoying. For some reason, I take it really personally. When he says, like, too heavy, he's, like, trying to blame me. It's not my fault that you're stupid enough to bring your backpack with you wherever you're going. Just be smart. Put it here on the chair. Put it here on the floor. And just bring stuff to the backpack. It's not my fault that you have to have it on your back all the time. Schmuck. Okay, so I think I've looted kind of all the doors besides the basement and other stuff. So let's find the fridge. Here go. There's the fridge. So I'll try to drop some things that I don't need because we have lots of food. Wait, how much food do we actually have? How many kilos? Eight kilos of food. So I think I'm gonna drop like a little bit stale stuff and stuff that I don't need. Like sodas, peanut butters, this goop. Oh, that's it. That's all the food that I had. Okay, what else is so heavy? Oh, I have a little bit of wood. I shouldn't bring with me so much wood, so I'm gonna drop this wood here on the floor. Let's drop this. So I already feel a bit better. Good, my guy feels great. Still a little bit heavy, but that's all right. I have lots of firearm cleaning kits and another firearm cleaning kit. Okay, I'll probably take this firearm cleaning kit and let's go close to the fridge. Where's that fridge? Here go, there's the fridge. I need to find some... Oh, a letter. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Epic, so, so interesting. <laughs> but I should read the note. Yeah, yeah, I should. Okay, so here in this cabinet, I'm gonna drop stuff that I feel like I don't kind of need, like, leather. At least for now, you know. I still have this book to drop here. Go, let's drop this, and I have a bit more space. And a few firearm cleaning, because that's why I came here. Drop, like, all of them. Then I'll get back here and take them again. No worries. That's somewhat good enough. So this is probably the door to go outside. Leave farmhouse, yes, to go outside. And this is to the basement. Let's go to the basement. Is the dead guy gonna be here? As he was dead in the basement? As she kind of killed her husband. I want to see if the dead guy is here. We're gonna check it real real soon. But the dead guy was staying here, correct? I think he's not here. I think in the story mode, there is no dead guy. Not in the story mode, but in the survival mode. Okay, so we're gonna start looting from the beginning. I just wanted to see if the guy's dead here. And apparently it's not. Okay, so we go down here. Scrap metal. I don't need the goop. Metal shelves. Goop, goop, goop. Some reclaimed wood that I could use probably to cook that meat, so I'll take it for now. Another TV that looks on the back, it's stressing me out. I would probably turn it around <laughs> so that it faces me. Wooden matches, I don't need them. Mittens, I don't need them. Well, this place doesn't really have that much loot. I thought it has more. I'm happy that I didn't leave the crowbar back in that locker, back in that shelf or something. Decent this. insulated boots. No, you could not. We could probably take plant or fuel for this. Let's take it. Worn ward boots, I don't need that goop. So yeah, probably I'm gonna harvest some fuel from it. Fishing tackle. Let's take it. Maple syrup. Let's take it. Let's take it. Oh, food! Combat That'll boots. Are combat boots good? Well, maybe these work boots are better than the boots that I have over here. Where are they? Like these boots. They don't really seem much better. Like those other boots. They don't seem that much better. And they're a bit heavier. So you know what? I'm just gonna craft those better boots and that's it. I'm not gonna bother about those other boots. Unless they were good already. But they're heavy. 70% 2 kilos. Wait, let's try to equip them. Let's try to see if they are much better. They're 1 kilo. Like, uh, look at this. I mean, they give protection against water and they're not that... They don't make me that much slow. Something's gotta go. Shut your mouth again! Something's gotta go. It's like he's thinking for me. You know, nothing. Okay, shooting guide. Yeah, I'm gonna take it. We'll definitely learn that to get more skills. We've already looted that washing machine. Let's loot this. That's it. I think I've looted this entire basement. Wow. Wow. Really kind of surprised that it's so bad. Really surprised that it's so bad. I mean... It's a basement. I would maybe expect here more wood or something. And from here, we can go outside for those who don't know. We're just gonna spawn outside, so it's useless. What's the point to go there? Okay, bandage. Don't need this energy bar. 
Let's take it. I can put probably this away and we're gonna see stuff now. Yeah, yeah, no need to waste my lantern now. Well, that's it. Let's get back here. I'll drop... Oh, I found some chips. Ketchup I chips. Can I eat them? I don't... I don't think they're good. So I'm gonna get back quickly to the fridge and I need to drop lots of stuff to bring the meat here to cook it and then to eat it. But wolfos are gonna see me. Is it smart? I don't think so. We already have lots of food though. Okay, so I said that I'm gonna dismantle one lantern. So let's take this lantern. Let's go to actions. Let's harvest it. It's gonna take one hour. Not that big of a deal. Let's harvest the goop from it. Here we go. Metal and the lamp oil. Beautiful. So I'm gonna go here. I'll drop the metal. And in this cabinet, I think I'm gonna drop some lantern fuel because I really don't need that much. Look at all this lantern fuel. Transfer all. Here we go. Now I have enough stuff to bring all the meat and run. It's still pretty bright outside. So yeah, here we go. Let's leave the farmhouse. Again, if I were you, I wouldn't do this. Don't do this. It's stupid. Oh no, it's blizzard. I'm going back inside. Wow. So we have to stay here and repair my clothes then. Let's go. Let's repair the clothes, baby. I found some more soda. Let's pop that soda. How did I miss it? I thought that I looted this entire house. Like, I'm pretty sure there's still some stuff that I've missed. 100%. There's gotta be something useful that I've missed. But doesn't matter. Hey, let's start reading, reading books and repairing my clothes. Let's go over here. So what I need to repair? Why my pants are 7% frozen? How do I dry them? Well, actions. I'm gonna repair it. I just need some cloth. Yeah, let's repair it. It's gonna take us. I don't know how long, but... I failed to repair my hat! With that good sewing kit. I still can't repair a chain success. Well, I'm gonna take a better sewing kit. Maybe that's why... I still can't repair my hat. Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me? I've read so many books about repair stuff. Do I have that book here about repairing maybe? No, I don't have another book about repair kits. But are you kidding me? I'm so good with repairs. And to be honest, everything is still good. Even though the wolf attacked me, I didn't lose anything. Like everything's at 100% besides like these pants. Can I go and try to repair them at least a little bit? You know, let's try. Chance of repair, 85%. How do I fail to repair them with a chance of 85%? I don't understand that. How are they frozen? They are wet. How are they wet fully? Did I pee myself or something? How do they become wet? Maybe because I went outside and that storm just made it wet, but I don't understand. Oh, maple syrup that I missed. Well, I guess let's start reading the books about the kitchen. Yeah, let's go. Let's read the book about the kitchen right now. Here we go. Let's use it. Oh, I even have another book about the frontier shooting guide. But about the kitchen, let's read it for three hours. Maybe the weather is gonna be a bit better outside. I don't think it should stay. It's still stormy. Let's read for two extra hours. I said I'm gonna stop it because I'm kind of getting thirsty. What about my pants? Are they drying while I'm reading? Yeah, they are drying a little bit. Here, we're gonna read for two extra hours. And probably we're gonna go there next morning because look at this. It's night now. I was able to research that thing again. Did I get better novice something? Nope. I don't even know where to see my skills, to be honest. Oh, here guys, see my skills. My cooking skills are over here in my rifle firearm. Accuracy range increased by 20%. Critical hint chance increased by 15% in three conditions per repair action. I have no idea what it means, but hey, that's good, I guess. Mending is a 65% chance of successful repair. 65% chance, and yet I failed so many times in a row. Cooking, 10% calories from any cooked food item. Okay, so we need to try that cooking. There are lots of books that we can read. That's beautiful. Maybe we're gonna wake up fully rested, or maybe not yet, or maybe we'll wake up in the morning. It's stormy again! Why?! You survived 12 days. Well, it's morning. I woke up to pop some sodas. Oh, I just saw that I haven't looted this container up the very top. And it was empty anyways. Wait, are my clothes dry? They should be dry. Yes, my clothes are fully dry. And I must be not the only one who feels like these shoes here look like icicles. You know, like my shoes are completely frozen. So could I read? It's not that super dark now. I think we could read a little bit. Okay, so we read that kitchen wilderness. I'm just gonna drop it over here. No point to keep garbage in our inventory. Am I right? So let's try to read this hunting. Oh, I read that as well. About kitchen, about hunting. Well, there's another book that I haven't finished reading. It's 25 hours of reading. So let's try to read it for like two hours. Yes, we can. So I'll probably read it until... Here we go. It's not stormy anymore. Good. Finally, we can go out and do some stuff. I need to kind of drink. But again, I'm not going to cook water right now because the weather is better. Let's get back the goop. Let's go over here. Let's drop the... I shouldn't be probably dropping the storm liner. Whatever. I'm going outside with the storm liner. Please tell me it's a great weather. It's not too dark. It's not too foggy. Is it good? I think it's all right. It's all right. Ah, all those snow particles just come into my nose. <laughs> my nose freezes. Well, I'm gonna loot the car. It's on my way anyways. Ooh, that's not a goop. Stay on target. Needs this anymore. Ooh, we're gonna take the book. Beef jerky. 
We can take it. Grape soda. Let's take it. Nice. That was somewhat of a jackpot. That's a nice car. It's probably the most worthy car I've ever looted in my life in this game. Besides the ones where you can get uh, bullets. Requires spray bar. Yikes. Guess what? I lost that spray bar. I left it in, uh, at home. Some somewhat of a small, small brain. I could probably pop these two deers and harvest them and get meat from them. Instead of going back to that place because there I'm drying my guns there anyway, so yes, I do it pop them pop them Okay, all right. Thank you for your good suggestions. So I'll try to pop it twice real quick We're gonna get a bunch of meat if I could pop both of them I'll pop both of them, but I don't think it's gonna be possible. I'll get closer to get two shots. Well, let's go baby one shot And that deer is running away Well at least this deer we're gonna get eight kilos of meat. I don't think I need to dry anything else here. Sorry, dear. So at least we don't have to go back there for that meat. Hey, let's get all the meat. How much time it's gonna- Oh no, tool, where's my knife? Don't tell me that I left my knife at home. There's no way I left my knife at home. I took the knife with me. Well, I'm- Duh. I see another deer up there, but Cyric, you haven't even dealt with this deer. Cyric, Cyric. Don't worry. Come here, schmuck. Feel bad. But it is what it is. It is what it is. Food! Let's get the meat. It's gonna take us um, one hour. We could literally uh, gather everything and cure hides and leather here, but what's the point of that deer hide? Can I craft anything else with a deer hide? I don't know, man. Well, I don't really see anything else useful that I could craft, so I'm probably not gonna bother about it. I'm just gonna get the extra nine kilos probably of meat from this deer and only eight kilos. Okay, better than nothing. Let's get the eight kilos of meat. Yikes, that's gonna be lots of calories. We're gonna survive here for forever and a little bit. I wish the meat here gave more calories because it's really heavy. There is a lot of other stuff in this game that gives you better calories and it seems like meat is useless. Okay, what is this? Can I get this? Is that a bullet? Rifle cartridge. Oh, it's to carry. just an empty cartridge. Maybe we could refill it again with fuel. Maybe a feather. I don't need that goop. Let's go here, add fuel. We're gonna add another brick here and that's it. I'm gonna drop the other one on the floor. And let's start cooking meat. A uh, gummy vention, whatever that is. Probably just butchered the word, but whatever. Imagine cooking just on the stove like this without a frying pan. What a savage. All of them are gonna cook for an hour. This is beautiful! We're making progress! We're gonna eat. I'll have to eat all of this meat here. 880 calories, right? Like, for example, those stale crackers for 100 grams, they're like 600 calories. Like, that meat is just useless. I'll be probably eating it for the memes here while I'm at the base, but bringing the meat anywhere with you is useless. So yeah, hunting is kind of goop. It was still fun, not gonna lie. It was still fun to hunt. Well, luckily, no one has put us to sleep today, but we were able to put four deers to sleep. And if you want to go to sleep yourself, make sure to check out this epic go to sleep mug. You can also get a go to sleep shirt or a go to sleep hoodie link is down in the description a huge thanks to all of those who've already gotten cyric merch so i highly suggest you checking out my rust let's player click here on the second card and you'll go to my scum let's player hop over to my channel go to playlist and there you'll find a lot of other games that i played here on the channel if you're not subscribed yet definitely be sure to drop a subscribe button and notification bell to not miss any future videos and consider following me on instagram or twitter at epicyric mm -hmm. yep